Hello, here is a free complimentary inspiring quote. Now that that's out of the way, let's talk about Scratch. People have made some pretty amazing things in Scratch. Like, check out this ray traced Minecraft. That's just... That's just crazy. And someone put the Linux kernel in Scratch as well. Anyway, I've been playing around with GPU stuff lately, and so I thought, hey, why don't we make GPU bindings in Scratch? So, I did. Bro, I think I just got WebGP running in Scratch. And that was the first bit of progress I made. The next issue I needed to solve was input. Because nobody's going to be able to write shader code like this. The solution I settled on was getting shader code from comments by their name. And then making a selectable list of named comments. Another problem that I ran into is reading the buffer back from the GPU. Because the extensions API doesn't allow you to take list blocks as an input. Anyway, I raised an issue on the TurboWarp GitHub, and this amazing human being provided me with a solution. So I solved it essentially the same way as I did the buffer issue. I just made a drop down. But enough about issues. You probably want to see some results. Here I've got a loop which gets the square root of each of 6,400,000 items. I've written some code that does this on the CPU and the GPU. So let's compare the times. Wow, that took 4.6 seconds on the CPU and 0.6 seconds on the GPU. I'm going to come clean now. This is not actually Scratch. This is Turbo Warp because you can't really add extensions to Scratch. If there are any Scratchers watching this, I'm keen to see what you create. So feel free to join my Matrix room. 